What's up guys, welcome back to another weekly vlog. Today is Monday, and we're gonna start off this Monday by opening a package. It's not an unboxing. I actually ordered something in the mail and it came in today. It came in actually early. It's supposed to come in like later this week, but I got it early in the mail right now. So we're gonna open it, and I already know what it is, but you guys don't, so uh, let's show you guys. All right, so if you guys watched the last vlog, you guys already know that I got a uh, Shaolin Monks Johnny Cage figure. Mortal Kombat Shaolin Monks Johnny Cage figure. Well, I said that that was not gonna be my last Johnny figure, I hope. So, I uh, saw this one, and there was like one left on the website I was uh, getting it from, so here we go. Oh yeah. Now this one is in good condition. I got myself a Mortal Kombat 9 Johnny Cage. Now my camera is almost out of battery. There was the lighting. All right, here we go. My camera's about to die, so uh, I'm gonna show this really quick. Johnny Cage MK9, pretty good, pretty good. I saw this at Toys R Us when I was a kid, or not a kid, but when I was younger, I saw it, but I didn't have the money to buy it, and now I finally have one, so I'm super excited, and I will be showing my shelf in this video in this vlog so stay tuned for that all right guys so today is not tuesday not wednesday not thursday not friday not saturday it's actually sunday morning it's well saturday night currently it's like one o'clock in the morning so sunday technically um so i'll be uploading this later today but uh i can explain a lot happened this week and I was just very stressed out. My computer, I updated it to Windows 10 because my Windows 7 was janky and it didn't let me upgrade for free so I had to get Windows 10. It like deleted a lot of my files and settings so I had to redo those. And then I tried to use my external hard drive to back up everything but that was connected to my Xbox and then that deleted all my games on my Xbox. So. That means that I lost all my files on my uh, games on my Xbox One, uh, except for a couple games, but like I lost all my WWE 2K16 files, so no more Link to Fame, unfortunately. Just when I figured out how to get a title shot in the game, this gets deleted, and now I have no Johnny Cage, I have no uh, My Career Mode anymore, I don't have any characters downloaded. It's a brand new game now. It sucks. It really does suck. Um, it's not going to be the end of my WWE 2K videos. I'm going to be doing more cage match videos. I haven't done any recently, but I will be doing a lot more soon. Like, this is just giving me motivation to do more. Because I don't want to stop posting WWE videos because I like playing the game. Um, but I don't think I'll be doing any more 2K16 my career mode because it took me forever to get to that point. I don't think we're going to waste any more time doing that we might do it in 2k 17 but right now i think my career mode is done johnny cage retired he couldn't do it you know he's just not at his prime anymore guys he was like the champion in 2k 15 but 16 he couldn't do it so i know this vlog this week's vlog was kind of iffy um like i barely did nothing i think the last clip i have in this video was me opening my johnny cage figure and that's it so this vlog is probably going to be shorter than usual, but really, I like to vlog my highlights of my week, and if I have no highlights, I just don't vlog. So this week had a lot of downward stuff, not highlights. But anyways, let's get to the shelf. Alright, here is my shelf. This is just like an overview of everything, so you guys can take a, a glimpse of this. If you want to pause it, uh, you guys can and just take a look at it by yourself. But we're going to go in and actually individually look at the stuff I have here. Because I do show my shelf in the back of my unboxing videos. But uh, I never actually went in depth with what I have. Just because, you know, I feel like I change my shelf every every week or something like that. So it doesn't stay the same. So I don't want to show you guys this and then change it. Because I, I change it a lot. Anyways, here we go. So my first individual block right here. Also, my shelf, uh, my dad made it for me because my dad likes to make stuff. So, he actually made this whole uh, shelf. Anyways, here we go. Uh, the first one is my pop figures. A lot of them I got from boxes and my friends. The only ones that I actually bought were these two, which is Daniel LaRusso and Mr. Miyagi from The Karate Kid. Uh, those are pretty sick. I got a Dave uh, Minion, which is awesome because my name's David, so Dave. It makes sense. Got Jason uh, from my friend Jay. He got it for me for my birthday. Thank you, Jay. I uh, got Han Solo. I uh, got C-3PO. Dr. Emmett Brown. I need to get a Marty because 
you know, complete the whole Back to the Future thing. I got a Volt Boy bobblehead. This is my box of pins I have. Let me show you really quick. Um, I actually did a whole pin collection, so there you go. I don't want to take it out, but you guys get the gif. Um, there are two like mini arcades back here. They're filled with candy. Got my uh, battery charger, nothing too crazy. I got a mini uh, pop of uh, Daryl Dixon from Walking Dead. I love that show. Uh, I can't wait for the new, the return, the mid-season return, I don't know. It comes back February, so I'm excited. I also got this. This is actually a little poster from my first ever loot crate that I got, and it's uh, of uh, Daryl and uh, of uh, a zombie. I'm not gonna spoil it, but um, it just says, oh brother. If you guys watch Walking Dead, you guys get that reference. Anyways, so we got a little golden Homer donut monk dude. So that's my first shelf. Pretty cool. Next shelf. This is a, you know, I try to have a theme for my shelves, but now it's getting like too much, so I don't really have a theme anymore. But uh, we got, of course, this is the newest thing I have, the Pixel Space Invaders little figure, um, statue. We got Ryu keychain. So cool, so cool. I got the replica hoverboard. That is probably one of my favorite things that came in a loot crate. I got this rare um, figure here from a mystery bag from a loot crate, which is awesome. Our luck of getting like rare items is pretty good, so that's awesome. Got a little Mario Kart here, Terminator uh, Genesis Skull. We got a Street Fighter comic book. If you guys watch like all my unboxings, you guys will recognize a lot of this. Um, behind it, we got a South Park Stick of Truth figure. I don't know where to place it because the placement is not that good. Anyways, uh, we got a flash, a um, little wind-up toy here, Link container that has candy inside, Sonic figure, we got a little Minecraft cheetah, a grunt from Halo, two Aquaman action figures. If you guys don't know, Aquaman is my favorite DC superhero, so shout out to Aquaman. So we got a DC Unlimited Aquaman action figure here. I actually got this for like five bucks. It was on clearance at a store, and I'm like, yo, I'm picking this up. And then my friend got me a new 52 Aquaman for my birthday, so uh, thank you for that. We also got a Aquaman little yarn ornament that I recently got, pretty cool. And then I have a orange ghost up there, because it kind of fits with the orange theme here. Uh, we got Guile from Street Fighter. Got this from my friend too, thank you Connor. Then I also got two little bobbleheads. Ryu, Guile, you know, Street Fighter. Cool. So going up, we got this. This is actually a newer uh, reworked shelf because uh, now we got uh, the Mortal Kombat figures. This was actually only Gears of War. But I had nowhere else to put my Johnny Cage figures, so I just felt like putting it in here, and it kind of fits. So we got Baird, Marcus, Dom, Cole, and Carmine from Gears of War 3. We got Mortal Kombat 9, Johnny Cage. We got Mortal Kombat Shaolin Monks Johnny Cage. We got a mini Marcus Phoenix action figure in a box still in there. Uh, back there, we got, they're actually standing on my Halo um, container that came in a loot crate, so that's why they're like super tall. But uh, this is actually one of my favorite shelves now because of my Johnny figures. Really cool. I don't think I'm gonna be opening them because they just look so good at the packaging. I might have to get more Johnny Cage figures, man. I'm, I'm starting an addiction that I cannot stop. Going over here, we got our, uh, I don't really know what to call it shelf, but uh, we got like bobbleheads and stuff like that. So we got Deadpool, a little vinyl collectible. We got a Wolverine vinyl collectible. We got mini Wolverine up here. Scorpion, golden Scorpion for my uh, course edition of Mortal Kombat. Pac-Man. Uh, we got a bobblehead of Ant-Man that I got for a Secret Santa. Uh, for my friend uh, Anthony. Next shelf we have down here is another, you know, vinyl collectible. I couldn't fit Star Lord up there, but we got Star Lord. Uh, we got a not really a Rubik's cube, but it's a one of those games where you click the inside kind of cube. I don't know what they're called. Um, we got Jake the dog, little statue there. Batman again. It's kind of like these build uh, bi build figures. I don't know what they're called. I call them build figures. We got a wooden Joker. We got Man Bat from my friend Connor. 
Really cool. Man Bat's actually one of my favorite uh, Batman villains. He's cool. I like him. And the last little part of my shelf is my Power Ranger shelf. A lot of you guys don't actually see this because when I film my videos, you guys just see the bottom. Um, but you guys don't see this. This is my Power Ranger shelf, which I love a lot. It has uh, the Green Ranger, the mini Green Ranger that's missing an arm. He's been in battles. The Mighty Morphin Green Ranger Morpher. But this is not like the legit one. This is just like a little toy morpher that came with the, the mini guys. Uh, we got a like a clear see-through Red Ranger. My little brother put this here uh, because, you know, he's Power Rangers, but it's a squishy uh, Samurai Red Ranger. He's pretty dirty, but whatever. Jay got me this. Thank you, Jay, once again. Freaking sick. Red Ranger, Red Mighty Morphin Power Ranger wearing the gold shield. Freaking amazing. We got the black Mighty Morphin Ranger there. The white Ranger. The white Mighty Morphin Power Ranger is probably my favorite Power Ranger out of everything. And I know Jay is probably going to say, the Gold Zero Ranger is better. No, Gold Zero Ranger is good, but White Ranger is better. And then I also have a, um, you guys can't see it because I don't really know how to display this. The flute. The Green Ranger flute. And I also have Saba the sword, but I don't know where to put it because there's no room to put it on my shelf. And I forgot about the top of my shelf which is all my WWE action figures. I loved collecting these action figures when I was younger and uh, they kind of grew. They like, there's a lot of them up here. I'm not gonna show you guys all of them, but I will like slowly pan so you guys can see and uh, you know, uh, take a look at my collection. So I got the World Heavyweight Championship belt here and I also have the Indisputed uh, Championship. I believe that's what it's called. It's been a while, um, but okay. I'm gonna slowly go. Uh, I'm gonna try to name them off as quick as I can here. So we got Chavo, John Cena, Kofi, Jeff Hardy, um, Batista, Umaga, Mr. McMahon, uh, Matt Hardy, uh, Greg Khali, Batista, Jeff Hardy, Jeff Hardy, Matt Hardy, Matt Hardy, Undertaker, Jeff Hardy, uh, MVP, Jeff Hardy, Taz, Santino, Matt Hardy. You guys can see a lot of Hardys. I love Hardys. Um, John Cena, Matt Hardy, John Morrison, CM Punk, Matt Hardy, Booker T, Randy Orton, Big Show. Anyways. You guys can see that I have a lot of figures, all right? I have a lot of figures. But uh, yeah, that is all my figures on my shelf, all right? A lot of you guys have been asking for me to show my shelf, and I finally did. And uh, don't get used to this, because I'm probably going to change it in like a week. But right now, it's going to stay like this for a while. And also, you guys have been mentioning this. Yes, this is my Bruce Lee painting. Um, it's a painting. It's not actually a uh, poster. It's a painting. This was actually like 200 bucks, but I talked the guy down to 80. So the deals, the deal. I don't know what this is. The deals. And then I also have my um, YouTube plaque for 100,000 subscribers. Freaking amazing. Once again, thank you guys for all the support. I believe the channel is now at like 142,000, which is crazy. Now that I'm showing this, I'm just going to show like uh, this too. This have been asked a lot in my vlogs and uh, you guys are like what is this this is actually I can't even fit it in the frame this is a Brotherhood of Steel Fallout uh, flag it's freaking awesome I love it I actually didn't know what to put on this wall so it was like a giant blue emptiness but now that I have this it kind of you know fills the room up but that is it guys that is my little corner over here I got my couch I got the little dog from Fallout, and I got BMO. But that is the end of the vlog for this week. This week, I did really nothing, guys. I pretty much spent the week trying to recover from all the things I lost on my computer. It really sucks, dude. It really sucks. I really was getting into the Lame to Fame. I have one more episode of Lame to Fame that I recorded before everything got deleted. So I might upload that video and just tell you guys, um, the people that don't watch the vlogs, what's gonna happen with Lame to Fame and what is the future for WWE on my channel. But uh, that is for another video. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this week's vlog. I know this week's vlog was nothing too crazy, but again, that's why I'm doing weekly vlogs because I am not a huge YouTuber. I'm just, you know, like an average size, I think, above average. So I don't get to go to like events every week. I don't get to, you know, fly to special stuff. Sometimes I do, but not all the time. So that's why I don't do daily vlogs because really there's nothing that exciting. If there is something exciting in my life, I'll record for you guys. Actually, I'm going on vacation in like a couple weeks. So I will be bringing the vlog camera and uh, vlogging 
my vacation and uh, I won't tell you guys where I'm going. I know I think some of you guys already know but uh, I'll tell you guys later. I almost forgot that I need to make this announcement for you guys. A lot of you guys have been asking for me to do Fan Art Friday again. If you guys don't know what Fan Art Friday is, a long time ago I did a series called Fan Art Friday and you guys can guess um, I showed off the fan art that I got every Friday. No, Fan Art Friday is not coming back. But I will be showing all the fan art I get from you guys on the vlogs. So if you guys want to get your fan art in the vlogs, just you know, draw a picture of me wearing my red hood or sunglasses or something like that and send it to me on Twitter at Uncaged Games or tag me in your Instagram posts uh, and I will try to get a picture of it and put it in the vlogs. Do not send me a direct message on Instagram because I do not check my DMs on Instagram because I just don't like that uh, feature at all. So if you guys want me to see it, send it to me on Twitter or tag me on Instagram. But here is the first fan art to make a return on the channel. His name is Connor. He's not my friend Connor. He's a viewer Connor. He's part of the Cage family Connor. But here is his fan art that he drew of me rocking a lightsaber. Look at that guys. That is pretty sick. Thank you Connor for uh, drawing me this. He actually drew me a fan art before. But uh, yeah, he drew me this sick drawing of me with my signature red hoodie, the shades on, and holding a lightsaber. Your boy's a Jedi Master right now. And it says Uncaged Games. Thank you so much, Connor. Really do appreciate it. Uh, very sick, very cool. I love it. So if you guys can just draw something that looks like me or something that you know I like, um, I will you know try to put in the vlogs. At least try to attempt to draw me. At least have a guy wearing a red hoodie so I know that you're drawing for me and not drawing for like uh, I don't know PewDiePie. But I hope you guys enjoyed this week's vlog. If you guys did, give the video a like. You guys have been killing the vlogs. I really do appreciate it. Everyone that watched the vlogs, you guys are awesome. I love you guys. So keep on liking the videos, comment down below, and let me know what things you guys want to see in the vlogs. Like, I am up for pretty much anything, almost everything. So, uh, you guys said that you guys want to see my shelf. I showed you my shelf. So let me know what other things you guys want me to uh, record. Uh, I think I saw some people saying like, show your college. So I might do that uh, this week's vlog, but uh, we will see. Remember, I upload a new vlog every Sunday. So, you know, come back Sundays to see what I'm doing throughout the week. But like the video, subscribe if you guys are new. My name's Uncaged Games, and you just got caged. People's faces, whatever. This is like a cute and cuddly one. I don't know, man. I'm a little scared of this. All right, look at that right there. Oh my! Oh! Oh! Woo! All right. Good thing they didn't ask to see what's on that shelf.